So you just finished your floor tour of the 2019 North American International Auto Show. Tell us some of the things that stuck out, what you were blown away with, or some things that really foster excitement looking forward. I think there's so many amazing things that are happening here when it comes to connected vehicles or autonomous or ride sharing, electric. I mean, we are on the cutting edge of, of so much R&D that's happening and design and Michigan is the center of it. And that's what we want to we want to maintain that. And I think when you get here and you get to touch and sit in and see the cars, do the virtual reality you really can get excited about what the possibilities hold for us and why we need to keep investing and in making sure that we are the leaders in this space. The North American International Auto Show brings in thousands of media spectators, thousands of hundreds of thousands of showgoers uh, and industry representatives over the course of the better part of three weeks. Yeah. Talk to me, talk, share with us on the the economic impact that it has in not only downtown Detroit, but the region and the state as a whole. Sure. Well, I don't think Michiganders sometimes understand the enormous impact of the International Auto Show being right here in, in Michigan. People are coming from around the world. They're coming, and when they show up, they see that we are on the cutting edge, but they also get to see Detroit, what is happening in downtown Detroit. It trickles out into the local economy in such in enormous ways that people don't readily see, but but we know um, just from looking at what it means for, for businesses here in, in Michigan. Talk to me about how you see some of the opportunities and uh, how the, the dynamic auto show might be able to shift during the summer month as opposed to in the winter. Well, you know, when you are able to do some things outside, you know, we could display on top of Kobo, right? Or get out into, you know, the city of Detroit or, you know, with our Canadian partners, right? I mean, there's yep. so many opportunities with the waterfront. This is a really unique state. We've got talent, we've got grit. Um, and, and I think that this will give us just one more way to demonstrate how unique we are and why business should come to Michigan and invest and employ Michiganders in good paying jobs. That's great. And again, I know you're incredibly busy. Thank you so much for Thanks, your time Andy. today yeah. and enjoy the, uh, the rest of the show. Thank you. Thank you.